Hey, I'm Jeff Gordon, Director of PR at UB Tech Robotics, and here we're taking a look at our Iron Man Mark 50 robot. And uh, this robot we launched back in April, around the same time that the uh, latest Avengers movie came out. And of course, you know, we really wanted to offer an awesome robot that fans of Avengers and MCU would, would love. Uh, and so Iron Man is a, an awesome robot that can basically do uh, anything that you would expect a robot to do. So you uh, have an app on your smart device and it can fully control the legs, arms, head, and every aspect of the robot. So there we see it moving backwards. And uh, it uh, has tons of play value. Uh, not just in controlling the robot and seeing, of course, there you see Tony Stark's face in there, but you can do things like, for example, upload your own face into the Iron Man robot so you can see yourself in there. Literally, I am Iron Man, right? It's awesome. <laughs> but um, in terms of play value, it also has an augmented reality experience, okay. uh, which we can't demo right now because yeah. we, don't, we don't have the AR pad that goes along with it. But you set it on a pad, you set up the AR experience, and then you have all kinds of drones and other things attacking you which is very, very cool, and you're controlling Iron Man to use his blasters to destroy uh, all of the enemies. So it's a lot of fun, and uh, you can play with this for hours and hours and hours. It's available now. It is uh, $200 on Amazon.com. You can find it uh, on other sites around the web. So check it out, Iron Man Mark 50 Robot by UB Tech. Cool, and what else are you showing off here today? Big fan of robotics. Sure, yeah, so why don't we walk just this direction a little bit. Uh, you can see here, this is our cruiser cloud-based enterprise service robots. And the idea here, uh, it's dancing, which is a lot of fun, but this is really a business-oriented robot. This dancing is a fun kind of marketing tool that a business might employ to have the robot standing out in front of their retail establishment. And then people, you know, their eyes get caught by this dancing yeah. robot. They're drawn in. They want to come into your store. Uh, and then once they do get drawn in, you can use the touch screen on Cruiser's face to interact and learn about products in the store. So it's uh, integrated with the back-end inventory system of the store. So if you're looking for a specific product, you can look that up. You can find out if it's in stock. Walker will literally walk you to that product. If it's out of stock, it'll pull up the website and let you place an order right there. So it's a whole what we call retail 4.0 solution. Yeah, there's different dancing options because dancing is always a fun I demo with, with Cruiser. Yeah. Very cool. What else you got? So if we walk this uh, direction, I'll show you our aimbot which is our autonomous indoor monitoring robot. And uh, similar to Cruiser, which is for businesses, we know that some uh, very large businesses that run data centers have a, a really difficult challenge in monitoring all of their servers in the huge server racks oh, yeah. in the data center. And you know what, honestly, this is a solvable problem to monitor these because uh, the servers are, are basically very similar from rack to rack to rack, right? You've got a lot of lights and buttons and things that you just want to check to make sure they're in the right position. You want to make sure that you know the heat on the, the surface of the servers is acceptable within a certain range and so forth. And so our aimbot will go from rack to rack in your data center and make sure everything is acceptable. And if something is outside of a given range, then it will immediately notify your IT manager or whoever's in charge of the data center. So, cool. so uh, that's one of our business solutions. But let's take a look at more of our consumer uh, retail. Um, products that we have. Over here we have our Jimu Pro robot. Uh, this is coming soon, so this is not on the market just yet. And here at CES 2020 we're showing it for the very first time. The idea with Jimu Pro is uh, for the past several years we've had a line of buildable uh, robot kits for kids uh, called Jimu Robot. And Jimu Pro takes that concept to a whole new level with artificial intelligence and very advanced specs. So this, uh, this astronaut, for example, uh, in our Mars Expedition Kit is essentially a Linux computer. Uh, it has a very, very advanced artificial intelligence built into it. It's got a camera built into it with facial recognition. It can, it can uh, recognize your, your gender and your age and, and other characteristics. And then uh, it, can, it can walk, it can move its arms, you can interact with it in all kinds of ways. And importantly, this is what the product is really all about ultimately, is you can code it on your smart device using the very simple, easy to learn Blockly programming language. So kids, and this is for uh, kids aged five and up, uh, they can get their hands wet with learning how to program and doing it in a fun way that's inspiring because yeah, what, kids. what oh, yeah. kid doesn't love space, right? Yeah, exactly. And the idea of exploring Mars. 
So this, this Jimu robots uh, line that I mentioned, here's a great example of what you can do with our Jimu robots. We've actually taken a bunch of parts from a number of different kits, and we've created this gigantic contraption that uh, pulls together all of the parts that we possibly could in order to make this ball run through kind of kind of kind of a gauntlet of different activities so it's running throughout CES uh, it is a, a wild thing to see in person and basically 90% of all of the parts that you see here are off-the-shelf GMU robot parts that anybody can buy and play with at home so if we continue on to the next table I'll show you what those GMU robot kits look like if you were to buy them uh, from uh, any retail outlet, let's say Target or Amazon or what have you, and then build the character that's in the box. This one that's closest to us is the Unicorn Bot. My that was, that. Yeah, this is very popular with a lot of girls, and importantly, I think, you know, really opened up coding and building with robots to a whole new market, which is those girls who never were really attracted to a lot of the other robots in the past. And so this one's a lot of fun. You can see the horn uh, can be programmed different colors based on how the robot's feeling. Uh, you know, this is angry, obviously, and uh, you know you can create storylines. You can do all kinds of creative play with it, and have a lot of fun with learning how to code. Behind Unicorn Bot, we have our dragon, which is called Firebot. And then if we walk this way, we also have our Champ Bot, which is which is fairly new for uh, for this past holiday. This is a competitive sports robot. Um, it can fire a ball with a catapult that's on the back, so you sort of play basketball with it. And then with a scooper on the front, you can push a ball, uh, sort of like soccer. And so the idea here is that for kids who are getting involved in the area of competitive robotics, which is so popular in middle schools and high schools these days, this is going to be a very first entree into that space of competitive robotics. And then lastly, we have our MeBot 2.0 which is an Apple Store exclusive. It's a dancing robot. Its eyes light up different colors. It can do all kinds of wild, goofy dances and fun play. And uh, as I said, it's exclusive to Apple, so it's something that's very special that we did for customers who want to have that experience with their iPhones and iPads. Oh, this is amazing. Well, thank you so much. And where can we stay in touch? Website, social media wise, and everything going Yeah, on. so please check us out at ubtrobot.com. All our products are on there, as well as follow us on social channels. We're at UBTech Robotics. Thank you so much. Thank you.